Welcome back to my channel Asha's Tech Studio. Today I am going to develop a travel guide application in Android Studio. In this part, we will design the home activity of our application. Whereas in the next part, we will design the travel guide details activity. I have created a new project in Android Studio. The name is India Tourism. Now I am going to paste the drivers. I have collected this from pixabay.com. This profile picture is generated from Blush. Now I am copying this and paste in this driver directory. Let's start designing this home screen. So this is the profile picture. The font used in this application is Nuneto Sans. So I will use this style extra bold. This is the welcome message. We can say that this is the heading of our application. the corner radius and the elevation while setting elevation first when we will enter the value in this it will not show the shadow now we will have to add another attribute in this state list animator it would be set to null now it will show the shadow in uh, the layout validation tab and it will also show it during the runtime also now here we will make a recycler view this is the heading top to list destinations font family is bold Now here you may also add uh, a link see all it would be the text now to make it a link we will go to the strings xml we will use the a attribute I mean the A tag of HTML and href attribute. It will be nothing because we will not open any web link through this see all text. Now 
now its color is changed we'll change the color to this blue this so shade of blue yo like this Recycler view. We will collapse. All the tags now. The parent would be scroll view. It would be a scrolling activity. That's why. Okay. Cover everything with uh, within the constraint layout. Now it's done. So now it is time to create the layout file which will show the recycler view. inside this constraint layout and another card view I am using the card view here because I want to add the radius here too and inside this card view there would be our image of the place No, it's done. This is the name of the C 
city and it would be the name of the state. One last thing, elevation. So now, just give the IDs. Now here is the coding part. We have to create a model class. Let's uh, name it as Tourist Destinations Model. generate a constructor then we will generate the getter and the setter ok now we have to write the adapter Now we will create class named view holder. Stains cycle view view holder. It will tell you to create a constructor matching super. And then we have to write uh, the context, my context, and this model, this model. So now let's. Create the constructor and then implement the methods.
here we will have to make the layout inflator get the uh, layout inflator so now we will have to apply the adapter the controls the data we have to apply it to the layout this image this name and this state so for this on create view holder in this method we will have to create a view the name can be my view and then layout inflator from this my context we'll have to inflate the layout name home recycler view layout then return this new view holder now in this view holder it is item view so we will return new view holder my view now we will create the elements such as the image view and the text views Now in this method on bind view holder whatever data is in the adapter we will have to fill the data in the image name and state elements so for this will create the tourist destination model just name it as model 2 because its name is model 1 so this what is this model 2 this model 2 is the position the get position of the model first model means this are released so now we will apply the model 2 positions in this elements like view holder 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 image set image resource model 2 image just like this so this is the position of the image this one is the position of the image similarly now this is done this adapter class is done now we will proceed to our main activity in this main activity first of all we will define the recycler view let its name be tourist destinations
now one or released this model or released and this adapter also along with this we will also define a linear layout manager now let's declare what is today's destination recycler view so it is this recycler view its id is so we will write the id okay now this model so new or released now finally we are going to write the data so how can we write the data like this add so in this array list we are going to add the data like this new model now as we have written in the constructor image name and state so first of all what is our image so the first image would be of delhi so our dot drawable delhi now the name of the city is new delhi and the state is delhi like this copy this i will fill four items in this recycler view you may also add more items the second would be jaipur so like this you have to fill this so like this i have entered the data i have add I have added the data in body list. Now we will call this. Uh, we will declare this adapter. The context. This and the model. The array list. So this array list models. now also declare the manager so what is so i want that the list would be in the horizontal orientation so for this i am going to so the context this now we will have to write the orientation so horizontal reverse layer false now we will have to set the adapter and the manager in our recycler view so to this destination set adapter now in my application the home screen i also want to add another recycler view which will show the top tourist attractions so there would be four items in that recycler view for this i will simply copy and paste these classes and the controls 
because the layout would be the same. like this and change the text Now finally we will edit all these. So now I have created two recycler views. One for destinations, top destinations and the second for top attractions. So here in this array list I have added all the attractions, the four items and then I have set the adapter and layout manager. So our part 1 of this video is completed. I will try to upload the part 2 as soon as possible. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel and like this video. And share this video with your friends. And I will try to upload the source code in Google Drive. And send the link in description and comments. Thank you.